Welcome back to Let's Play Bomberman Hero. Today we are entering Planet 2, Primus. Ooh, and it looks so green and cool. Yeah, first level is called Groog Hills. And our old friends are back. <laughs> Finally, Mr. Peabot is in the beginning of the video. I just realized something terrible. I cannot look down. <laughs> I have no idea what I am stepping in. If you knocked me over now and left me, I would die a horrible death. Isn't that an amusing thought? Clap, clap, clap. <laughs> I can smell the princess. I would recognize that scent of eucalyptus and butter anywhere. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's aloe vera, but she doesn't have a sunburn, so I can't quite tell. <laughs> fucking whatever. <laughs> Go to the fucking ship! <laughs> Alright, Groog Hills. These are the eponymous Groogs. These guys are fun to mess around with, because all they do is charge. Which means, if you're not stupid like I was there, you could just drop bombs in front of them. And of course you did that for example sakes, you know, because, you know, well, just in case people do something wrong, this is the way to do it. Yep. If he goes, I'm dropping bombs, uh, don't, don't interrupt me! Okay. <laughs> yes, now Peabot shows up whenever you pick up those, uh, walkie-talkies. <laughs> I, I love doing that. Like, you don't even have to drop it in front of them, just drop it in front of you, jump, and then they run right into it. I can't discern Bombermen from bombs. It's <laughs> depressing. Oh, is it my birthday? My birthday? birthday. <laughs> uh, those, those guys are fun to mess around with. This overall level is actually pretty fun, if you know what you're doing. Oh boy, a sandwich block! <laughs> <laughs> this one's extra stupid. Look, he's still learn, charging. Learn how to jump! <laughs> Drop a train on him. He's trying to evolve before he killed him. Yeah. I took him out of the gene pool. Uh, there's a power-up over here that I always missed, but now I know where it is. And this box right here, it looks like you needed to get that crystal, but if you ended up doing this, you can do this. <laughs> God. <laughs> and this... Let's play, ladies and gentlemen. Let's just show you how to kill yourself to get a gem. <laughs> Yes, obviously you don't want to do that if you have just one piece of health left, but... Come on, that means you got three good shots, so if you miss, I'm well, sorry. <laughs> well, I imagine it's like the developer is throwing you a bone. I don't know what these are, they're just big flowers, and... I killed them before they actually attack, but they attack by getting angry and spitting bubbles at you. Looks like there's a very consistent anger in all these creatures. I've seen one of them that looked very happy. This, whatever empire it's called, it's just spreading frustration throughout the entire galaxy. <laughs> All right, swinging your arms now, apparently. Yes, this is the rolling bomb I mentioned previously, but this is the first time I've actually needed to do it. And uh, you have to be right in place for it to work, because uh, the idea is to hit those two bulbs on each side of the flower. But even if you hit it, you have to, it, it doesn't count unless you're in this right place. Cocaine... World. <laughs> oh my god, it's an 80 rock star's dream come true! <laughs> yes, just by blowing up that flower, we have made a winter wonderland. <laughs> it's logical, stop questioning it! Uh, these crystals were actually... You could kind of see them off in the corner, but you couldn't get them because they were on the lake. And, and if you were dumb, you would have jumped into the water trying to reach them. Yeah, based on the earlier part of the Let's Play, no, you don't jump in the water to be able to get said crystal. <laughs> it, it doesn't work all the time, I'm afraid. I, in fact, I think I tried it in my earlier years. <laughs> oh, we were young and stupid back then. Uh, now we're old and stupid now. Yep, yep. <laughs> hey, I didn't deny that. I say we're <laughs> older. Then you have to run all the way back, because now there's nothing left. <laughs> it's hard to breathe in the snow! <laughs> I'd love to see him just run and just wipe out. <laughs> <laughs> just, yay! <laughs> Threaded the needle. I did it! Just broke my tailbone! <laughs> that would be great. Just trip on himself like Smash Bros. Brawl. <laughs> Baby, this is Bubble Hole. Bubble Hole, and there... It lives up to its name. There's bubbles everywhere. That enemy was in a bubble. And now hop on that pile of stuff. Rubber muscles. I don't know, but yeah, they make you bounce. And uh, this diamond is technically 
in a place where you need where you would technically need a uh, teleporter to get, but you can use that mat to reach it instead. There's a bunch of these Dragon Quest blobs. We got the big smiley faces on them. And big green floaty thingies. Yeah, well, I don't think any of them have smiles on them. No, <laughs> they just have creepy eyes. Uh, yeah. No, I don't know what these are, but they're just annoyances, really. Um, the little ones are the usual ones. It just takes one bomb to get rid of them. But when they merge and become big, it takes like four. So kill them as quickly as it can. They don't look like they really do anything, though. They're just kind of chilling like all the other creatures in this game. Yeah. Oh, and the eponymous bubbles, when you destroy them, they just respawn, so don't bother. But the thing they come out of is actually where the teleporter is. Yeah, this... Get him! Oh, okay. This level just doesn't make sense. Aw, <laughs> oh, poor clown snail. <laughs> it was in a bubble, it had to die. <laughs> No one lives in bubbles and bubble hole! <laughs> Not when I'm around. Pain in the ass, big one. Oh, I hate these fuckers. <laughs> it's even worse if they're little and you have the chance to kill them before they get big, but you just don't. They're just full of regret. Yeah. You're just sitting in misery. <laughs> Why? I gotta hit him four times! <laughs> I will not call him George. I HATE THE PEAK OF THIS THING I'M ON! <laughs> yeah, the red ones are so angry, they actually spit fire at you. There are more clown snails. And excuse me while I have a psychotic attack and attempt to kill all of them. <laughs> yeah, clear. <laughs> well... Alright then. You can't deny it didn't work. It, it, it certainly did. You know, aiming would be more impressive, though. I mean, that just might be me. <laughs> it's not like I wasn't trying. <laughs> but, yeah, that's how you get the Adduck Bomb. You can probably jump on the, that little tiny pillar to reach it, but I've never managed it. We are above a bottomless pit, so I wouldn't recommend it. Oh, bottomless pits. It even looks like there's ground, but it's lying. So how many times have you jumped in thinking it's ground going, Hey, look, solid feet and fuck! Uh... Maybe three times since I rebought the game. <laughs> Error strike! And we got another water level. Prepare to be nommed. <sighs> no. <laughs> Nom! He really does look like he's eating his legs. Bummer! Just broke both my legs. <laughs> Bummer! Eaten. He gets bigger, eats his legs, and then retracts. It's like he's chewed up. I'm a Stingray and I'm pissed! <laughs> He's passive aggressive, Steve, right? He's stingray. And those ones just. those spy things just don't look amused. <laughs> My existence is meaningless. What the fuck am I? That one's even more meaningless because those things just don't do anything. They just kind of <laughs> scuttle around. And that one just committed suicide. <laughs> I think it just flew right into that little pillar. It's like, I'm gonna shoot you and eh. I mean, I could head at you and blow up in front of you, but I just... I'm out of <laughs> oh, state. fuck, you got torpedoes, huh? Well, <laughs> god, fine. Underwater old man, oh god! <laughs> How does retirement home get underwater, oh god? And the Tiki Heads make their return. For no fucking reason. <laughs> What's an ocean like without Tiki Heads? Easter planet. <laughs> of course, we have a clam shooting missiles. Uh, yeah. And he just got hit in the face by a tiki nose. Yeah. What are the stingrays doing? I'm not happy. Neither am I. <laughs> They're just kind of standing around begrudging life. You see, I killed Steve when I was framed. <laughs> I died before Steve Irvin was even around. <laughs> and of course we got starfish swin uh, swimming in a circle, but you don't even technically need to f uh, swim through them to get the things. Because I think like the uh, crystal and that life are just behind them. So what's the point? Hey, bud, look at my belly! Yes, <laughs> <laughs> we now have a giant stingray. I am going to kill you. I am going to kill. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> Large creatures have a tendency of vibration. <laughs> Just like cell phones and guinea pigs. I'm sure this isn't relevant, but when I was little, I had a dream that I got bitten by a rabid hamster. Uh huh. And it caused me to vibrate. <laughs> Maybe you're a giant enemy to that hamster. And then when it hit you with its bomb, you went, uh. <laughs> Maybe. I played Bomber Hero when I was little, so hey. Maybe it translated. And just swam through the ocean sphincter, alright. Yay, this is one of two exits you can take. Uh, like with Planet Bomber, the two exits lead to separate uh, maps. So when we're finished with this one, I'm just gonna bum rush the second one. Well, good. Kinda hard to see this part of the level. Yeah. Well, the draw distance isn't great. What are those? Uh, I'm not sure what they are. I think they're called remores. Or not. They're the tiny sharks that cling to big sharks. Oh, okay. Yeah. But they're you bigger than you. Yeah, you saw them clinging to the big uh, stingray. Except these ones can die. <laughs> not too much good luck of not shooting yourself in the face. Uh, well, at this point, I kind of stopped giving a shit. <laughs> the ocean's muscle! <laughs> <laughs> You know what the best part is? I've already passed the amount of points I need to get the five points. <laughs> like so. this is, they should call this place Testosterone C with all the muscle in it. That blocks your camera, apparently. I don't. Okay. Yeah, muscle may not be far off because I don't know what that is. It really does look like muscles. You should call this Testosterone Suicide Lake because everyone keeps on either hitting themselves with bombs or having muscles flexed at them. You say you can forget about me! We're just standing around irritated. You think you were done watching me vibrate? Well, you in for another show entirely. <laughs> Bring it on, bomber boy. I can take anything you shoot at me. I'm not. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> it's vibrating so fast that it's like creating two of them. <laughs> I, I even turned off resampling. It shouldn't be doing that. That's funny. <laughs> now, see, that, that one mine is... Eh, I'll just die. Whatever. <laughs> First, I'm going to grow big for no reason. <laughs> you can't get this, no, this whole... Oh, shit. Got too big. Now. now for the second exit. This one is over in the top left. And this is how you should really fly through a level. Yeah, well, if you're not trying to get perfect yeah. scores. Yeah, if you, don't, if you don't want scores and shit. If you're not trying to do 100% fucking Let's Play. This... I feel like you accomplished something before you finished college. <laughs> Missile clam. <laughs> <laughs> this thing down here lets you uh, and, like go through certain walls, but only one type of wall. It's that thing you can see at the very end. This, do the stingrays really do anything? I mean, they're just kind of sitting there. No. Well, they give you points when you kill them. Oh, I guess they do that. <laughs> that's all they're worth. That's they all they give they're you an for. intimidating look, and it's like, so what else can you do? Mer. <laughs> <laughs> mm. <laughs> Let's not find out, shall we? <laughs> this is a nice, relaxing level. The this has no soundtrack. It's just water. <laughs> and then you, I like it's like ah, oh, the relaxing sound of fuck it, bomb, bomb, bomb. <laughs> relaxing sound of. <laughs> Ah, uh, I'm glad I moved it. <laughs> Cute little shark, I'm gonna kill it. And a crab spitting bubbles. Ah, flip over. <laughs> Go through the ground and flip over. <laughs> Don't you just love an enemy with a top hat? Fuck yeah. You should see his nose. It's actually like a uh, sword or something. But uh, Just like any distinguished gentleman. Yeah. So that green thing is a teleporter, and that's all it was good for. So you can bypass that if you're sneaky like me. Technology of this planet's weird, because usually you push buttons, don't hit it with bombs. Yeah. Bubble. Oh, sh <laughs> Hello, good sir. My taste oh, God. <laughs> Hope you don't mind me being nosy. <laughs> oh, I'm allowed to be rich and witty. 
<laughs> oh, but now I'm dead. <laughs> Just let me live! <laughs> I won't say anything! Just go on! Breaking miss, whatever! Yeah, sure, just hang on to this bomb for me. Oh, sure, what is that? Oh my god! Speaking of bomb, go through the teleporter. There's a big one with the timer. So collect the dark crystals and get through as quickly as you can. Oh, fuck, never mind. <laughs> oh, that was, um, more brilliant moments with our hero, Bomberman. <laughs> our hero runs into a tree. Water slider, that level just sounds like fun. Yeah. In practice, it's just a little bit obnoxious. Well, they didn't add a soundtrack to this one either. Nope. They did bring back some of the enemies from Planet Bomber, like our not-so-favorite friend, the uh, battery thing. <laughs> now, to all you people who just loved waking up really early in the morning, it's your favorite soundtracks from your alarm clock, featuring such favorites as Waterfall and Ocean. <laughs> and Boing. And Boing. <laughs> This is one of the few levels where you can get over the, uh, like, uh, you just, like, in some levels, when you collect the adduct bombs, you can get, like, 50 points over the, uh, maximum. In this, you can get 250 points over. Oh, oh snap. Yeah. <laughs> Fucking <Okay>. die! <laughs> that one wasn't even, like, trying to dodge or anything. <laughs> this looks like, what is this guy doing? <laughs> Not even getting close. <laughs> I'm not too worried. <laughs> that was the first time I managed to grab that crystal without falling off. And those things are just tough. <laughs> I love springing! Those things instead, no. <laughs> those things are just not quite as lucky. I enjoy jumping! <laughs> <laughs> and when you get to the end, the, uh... Like, the area just kind of ends. No cutscene or anything. That was not a so great level there. No, it wasn't. It's kind of fun, but it's just not that great. Let's blow up some more shit! <laughs>